What's up, babes? It's your girl, Queen L. Eats. Woo, woo, woo. And today, I'm eating a cowboy steak. A cowboy steak, some ba uh, barbecue baked beans, and some asparagus, y'all. I'm hungry. Let me save my press so I can get it in. Heavenly Father, bless over this food for the nourishment of my body. Let it give me health, strength, and knowledge and everything you will have of me. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. How y'all doing? How y'all feeling on this Memorial Day? I hope good. I hope good. A special thank you to all the people who died on this mem um, for this Memorial Day. The reason why we're celebrating it. We're celebrating their life since they passed away. Um, yeah, y'all, this is Tweezy's first time cooking a, a cowboy steak. This is my first time eating one. I'm excited. We're going to see how it turned out. All right, I had to put it in the microwave, so I don't know if it made it tougher or what, but we, we about to see. I have a plastic fork and a plastic knife. It cut right through there, y'all, with this plastic fork and knife. It cut straight through there, y'all. Y'all know how when you, you cut a piece of tough steak and it be shaking the whole table. This one was shaking the whole table. <laughs> there you go. There you go. There you go, piece. There you go, piece. It's got a little red on it. That's not blood, but that's from the grill. Yeah, y'all. That's from the grill. Let me try this out. Tweezy, you outdid yourself, brother. This steak's so doggone good. It's melting in my mouth like butter. I'm, I'm cutting it with I'm cutting it with a plastic knife. Plastic knife. Plastic knife. And I ain't even shaking the table. You know how people be just shaking the table with a with yeah. steak or whatever, because it be tough. I guess I know what I'm doing a little bit. You know what you're doing a little bit. Look at that. Golly. Don't trim that fat. You seasoned it perfect. I got 57 sauce. I really don't need it. You did that. This cowboy steak is so tender. It reminds me of a rib. A rib? It reminds me of a rib. Of a beef rib. He did that, y'all. He did that. Your son trying to go outside. Tell him he can't go outside. The kid, the, um, his sister's sleeping. He trying to go outside. He want to ride his bike, y'all. Yeah, this steak right here. This steak right here. And I had one of my subscribers. I think she was a subscriber. I don't know if she subscribed or not, but she was like, y'all got real plates and using plastic forks and knives. Yeah, so it won't be banging on the plates, y'all. You know, that'll be real loud on y'all if we be banging on the plates. So I wanted to be considerate. That's all. Trying to be considerate. Yeah. These are the barbecue baked beans. That's what you want. That's what you want. Yeah, this steak. I I am amazed. Like I am literally amazed at how good the steak is. With how thick it is. I'm cutting it with a butter knife. Plastic.
That's good. Tweezy put his foot in there. I had them bought this steak about three three weeks ago. And I had it in the deep freezer. So when it was about to be Memorial Day, I, I took it out. And so it can defrost and everything for him to cook it. And it, it is delicious. If y'all ain't checked out my video on how I make my four meat turkey spaghetti, check that out. If you have extra sauce left, by all means, get you some freezer bags and freeze that sauce with that meat in it because it come in handy. You be like, I'm hungry. I don't feel like going out the house. Get you some spaghetti noodles, cook them, get that sauce. Out of that freezer bag, put in like a little, you know, a little saucepan on the stove. Put it on simmer and just let it just, you know, unthaw. And tear it up. God don't mind it, just stay good. It's a big steak Pulling no feelings out by chewing it or nothing. <laughs> AJ got tweezers to take him outside. I heard that screen door open and shit. <laughs> yeah, I worked out today. Me and my brother. Tweezy went. So I feel good about it. Are oh, y'all doing that, that dance with me where you up, down? If you are, leave a comment. Tell me that's what you're doing. We're going to see if this is going to work. Five minutes a day. But if you need to break it up, break it up. Because five minutes straight doing that is hard. I know. <laughs> I had to break it up this morning. I was doing it <laughs> to Michael Jackson's song, Dirty Diana. Dirty Diana. I said, oh Lord, I gotta stop. I need a break. Mm. 
I might have to slow down and stay. Yeah, I'm getting full. I'm getting full. Queen L is getting full. And whatever I don't eat, I'm going to cut it up and put in an omelet in the morning. Or I just eat it with a baked potato tomorrow. It won't go to waste. That's what I don't do. I'm not ready to just waste it. Now, I ought to eat. Look how much I still got left. It's like a regular size steak, not on it. I thought I ate all this steak. These beans bust. I hate these beans by themselves. All right, just one more piece of steak. <laughs> Yeah, that was delicious. That was delicious. I hope y'all having a wonderful, safe day today. I hope y'all are. Hope y'all enjoying your family and loved ones. If you ain't able to watch this video today and you end up watching another time, I hope you enjoyed your time with your people or your kids or immediate family or extended family, however you enjoyed it. If you enjoyed just having some peace and quiet to yourself, I hope that you was able to get that. If you decide to sleep the whole day on your extended weekend, I hope you got some good sleep. Whatever it is. Let me quit eating this. Y'all keep on cutting it. And I keep on eating more. This is the last one for sure this time. This last one for sure. This last one. This day was on point. All right, y'all. Like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell to be notified when I upload my newest videos. Peace out.